Uh, today's win, a tough win I think you'll agree, uh, where did you think the game was won today? Yeah, it was a tough game, Chris. Um, I, I think, to be honest, it, it was a bit of an arm wrestle, and you know, both teams slugged it out uh, in, in difficult, windy conditions. But um, I think the turning point for us was, you know, a moment of brilliance from uh, Bucks Bacosa on the wing there, where he started a counter attack and, and then finished it off under their post. You know, so so literally one moment of brilliance wins us the game. Okay, you've mentioned Bucks uh, on his first. Uh full game uh, today on debut. Yes. Who else then, um, apart from him, impressed you uh, out on the field today? Yeah, well, I know, as I said, you know, it's, um, it, was, it was a tough, tough game and I know lots of the boys stepped up today, but you know, in particular, I think, you know, our bench came on today and, and made lots of, you know, lots of good impact for us. I know Chris Lowry came on and made a good impact. John Old came on and made a good impact. And, and yeah, you know, those were the two players who were sort of, you know, at the forefront for us today. Good. Some positives there. Um, let's look at a few of the disappointing uh, efforts. 25 turnovers, um, I believe, was the, the total, yeah, yeah. And, and four visits to the red zone without um, points on the board. How, how will you take that back as coaching staff and prepare for the RLC game in December? Yeah, clearly, Chris, you know, the, the turnover situation, you know, unacceptable for us. You know, we set our standards quite high and, and we are disappointed with that. Um, you know, um, get into the red zone and not scoring. You know, we, we talked about being clinical before the game and, and being precise, but perhaps that didn't quite happen for us. You know, again, perhaps difficult conditions and, and maybe some players, you know, not, not sort of making clinical, you know, good decisions there. But, but you know, a win's a win, and you know, we'll take that away, and, and we're happy with that at the end of the day. Good. Um, last question then. Uh, you lost your fly half, Ken Davy, an hour before the kickoff. Um, how much of a disruption is that to the team in a situation like that? It was massive, just to be honest. You know, to lose your, you know, your playmaker, you know, it was, it was very, very disappointing. But you know, all credit to the players who, who stepped in. And we had to make three positional changes for one player missing out. Fraser Demon came in and played very well at ten. You know, not a natural ten, but came in and did a very good job for us. Uh, Noxie Lakuru was actually picked to play blindside at the start of the game. You know, then fitted in at inside centre and again had a good game and, and did what you know what Noxie does. Um, and then Richie Warmond and then came in off the bench and, and did a very good job on the flank for us. So yeah, far from ideal, but you know this side, you know we got excellent team spirit and a, and a great work ethic, and uh, you know we get on with things. And at the end of the day, we come away with a victory, and we're very happy. Great. Well, Gareth, that's four wins in a row now against the Gunners. Uh, they still hold the uh, the most wins in a row, which is six. Uh, congratulations on today. Uh, I'm sure you'll go away, reflect and come back stronger uh, against the RLC. And uh, we wish the team well and hope you have a good evening tonight. Thanks Thank very, very much. much Chris. Cheers. Have a good evening. Cheers, buddy. Bucks, well done. Um, you're today's uh, Sapper Rugby Man of the Match. You played for Reading uh, all of this season uh, on a Saturday in the Civilian Leagues. Uh, this is your first full game for the Royal Engineers. Uh, you came on as a substitute for Cambridge. How did you enjoy the experience today? Uh, it was quite good. Excellent. I yeah. just wanted to uh, live up to everybody's expectation while play. OK, good. Um, head coach Gareth Evans described your try as game-changing and game-inspirational. What do you remember from that uh, try going over behind the posts today? No, we just uh, saw the gaps and we made the most of it. Yeah. And I finally scored the try. Well, Bucks, uh, you're today's Sapper Rugby Man of the Match. Is there any messages for your friends and family back home that you'd like to say? No, I'd just like to say hi to my uh, mom, my dad, and my uh, brothers back in Fiji. Okay. That's all. Good. Well, many congratulations. Thank you.